Wait, so I just wanted to order a Happy Meal, but I, I was just curious because I wanted to know. I never tried it, so I don't oh, know. Oh, you never tried it? Oh, shit. Um, well, well, do you have a boyfriend? Hold up, hold up. Tell me what the hold up is. I'm a little okay. sport. I'll be the first to admit it. I'm not used to playing low about my feelings. Tell the world or write a book when I'm finished. Okay, today is gonna be a chill day. I think we're gonna make spaghetti, yeah. I saw a couple YouTube videos and a couple recipes and I think, I think I can do it, yeah. Spaghetti doesn't seem so hard. And then later tonight, I don't know, I'll worry about that later. It's sunny at the most days You'll never see the sky if you keep looking down And if you take the wrong way Maybe you should stay instead of turning around. So, but you keep. Mm -hmm. Ow, oh, that actually hurt. Let's go make some spaghetti. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is prep the beef. And then. Oh, oh my god. Oh shit, is it okay? Okay. And prep some other ingredients. And cueing the sad voiceover part in three, two. So this is a recipe or a proper recipe where I think I should tell you what's going on instead of telling you a random ass life story. So let's start with parsley. I like folding it in half because it cuts nicely. Now get them jalapenos and then cut them in half and then cut them small. We won't really use this until the sauce part later on, so put them aside just like your feelings and now continue with the onions. I cut them in half like this, but you actually have to do it for the whole onion or else your parents don't love you. So now the mushrooms, you wanna cut them real nice. Yeah, just like this. The garlic, I like to crush it first so that it cuts easier later. And now for the eight inch horse schlong. Garlic powder, black pepper, parsley, the one that we just cut, some chili flakes, some parmesan, two ovaries, and some breadcrumbs. And then give it a good old mix. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh right, salt, salt. Yeah, you don't wanna forget the salt cause you're a salty fuck. Okay, now you can give it a juicy mix. Okay, now roll up your balls. These were a little bigger than mine, but the size is really up to you. Put them in a frying pan, toss in the onions, and then give each ball the same amount of attention as any other ball. Now for the sauce. I use these imported tomatoes from Italy, but I got it from the supermarket, so it could just be made from China. The tomato paste is totally optional. Give it a good old blend. And now let's get our pasta water ready. Olive oil, salt, pasta noodles or spaghetti whatever you want to call it and now take out the meatballs they should look like this mm. now drain out the oil and then for the oil put them in a frying pan garlic onions okay honestly just all the veggies that you had in there a bit of butter black pepper thyme and then chili flakes and that should be it put in the sauce and then you want to stir it evenly yeah drain out your noodles set them aside and for the sauce i put it back in the saucepan actually this is so that it can simmer nicely i added in a little bit more chili flakes because i wanted it spicy add in the meatballs and right this is fresh basil yeah this is important it makes it taste so much better just trust me on that and the sauce is done serve it onto your noodles and wow look at this damn doesn't that just make you so fucking horny wow my first time ever making spaghetti from scratch. It looks so pretty. Okay, let's try this. First bite. I'm so excited. Oh yeah. Mmm. The meatball. Mmm. Dude, these meatballs are busting. Yeah. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> yeah, dude, like, I made the tomatoes out of canned tomatoes, and then the meatball all from scratch, bro. Bro, I'm telling you, man. Dude. 
Yeah, this is the little cooking stuff. Oh, you're doing it now. Mm-hmm. Holy shit. Mmm, we need parm. Parmesan. This is good, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed, bro. I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. This is... It's not that spicy, but it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Fucking sauce. Delicacy. It smells in the mouth. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? If you were to enter like a, a cooking spaghetti competition... 10 out of 10. I'll bet you all the money that you win. You come to this place. Meat boy, mm -hmm. Look at the meat boy, guys. It is just... Absolutely... Ah. Uh, Juicy, you see that? <laughs> Come dripping down. Fucking meatball nut. Meatball nut. If anybody recreates a spaghetti, tag me and tell me what you think of it. I guarantee you will not be disappointed. I think for dinner tonight, I'm gonna make some tang suyuk. It's a Korean fried food thing, but I need oil for that and I ran out at home, so we're gonna go get some right now. Ah. <laughs> So before we cook, boom, yogurt, lid off, hamster food, banana, oh wait, shit. Banana. Lately, lately I feel like I've put on a lot of weight. So I'm trying to cut and eat healthy, like, you know, bananas and hamster food. But every time I make of what I eat in a day, I always eat so much. Why can't I just, like, be able to eat a lot and be skinny? <laughs> and I'm not trying to, like, lose weight for, like, appearance or anything. Well, maybe a little bit, but the main reason is that some of my pants are getting pretty tight. I just want to be able to fit in clothes that I used to be able to wear. Maybe I'll get back into dancing. Or maybe if I find a girlfriend, and we just have a lot of sex, and then I'll just burn a lot of calories. That's a good idea. So, girlfriend applications, open. Because I want to lose weight, not because I want to have sex, because, you know, I feel like health and balance is very important. Okay, back to cooking. Okay, so this time, I'll actually tell a story. This one time, I went clubbing with some friends, and I was talking to this girl on Instagram DMs. I told her that I was going to be at the club that night, and she said she'll also be there. I wasn't really that close with her because I mean, I freaking just slid into her DMs, but I knew that if I saw her and if I could talk to her, I could buy her a drink and maybe get her number. But you know, girls at clubs, you guys always come in wolf packs and there's always that one gatekeeper friend that protects the group. So the group comes up the stairs. I'm with my friends at the bar and I see them come in. I'm thinking to myself, okay, it's my time right now. There's some Bryson Tiller playing in the back. The next track is Chris Brown. Kevin, it's now or never. Go talk to her. Now when I approach the girl I was interested in, this random ass drunk girl comes out of nowhere, fucking Dora the Explorer, and says, back off, she's my friend. I knew immediately that this girl was the gatekeeper of the friend group. Frickin' swiper, no swiping looking ass, but to be honest, I... I didn't know what to do, so I kind of just stood there like a dumbass, like dead ass. It felt like freaking five minutes gone by, but it was probably just like 10 seconds. The girl I was talking to, she noticed and she came up to me and then we tried talking for a bit and she tried to clear it up with her friend. But it's really hard to talk at clubs, you know, but I managed to get her Snapchat, I think. So uh, moral of story. Fuck, I don't know if there's a moral to this one. Anyways, back to the video. Oh, and in other news, this food actually turned out really good. Okay, that is all. So this is the final product. Wow. Mmm. It looks so tasty. Okay, mini taste test. Mmm. Not bad. Try a piece. What do you think? Mmm. What do you mean? The sauce? No, like the meat. Chicken. Oh. Yeah. It's good. Mmm. I'm impressed. What is it? What is it? It's like tongue suyu, but with chicken instead of pork. Oh. Yeah, dude. 
Guys, if you look closely, it might look like I have two different flavors because one's white and one's brown. But actually, it's because I burnt this one, so. So guys, <laughs> yo, chill, stop laughing, you're making me laugh. Oh, I walked out. I'm wet. Oh, it's because it's raining. What the fuck? That's like saying, oh, I walked out and I smell something wet. Oh, it's raining. Well, no shit. <laughs> so make sure you guys, guys, make sure when you're, when you're cooking it, put the heat on low and cook it a little longer. Okay, that is all. Guys, I'm at McDonald's right now, and we're gonna get a BTS meal. Let's go. Oh, what's the next one? Not this one. Hello? Yes, you. Hello? Hi. Do you have any BTS meals? Yes. Oh, okay. Do you have... Okay, I saw a TikTok video, right? And then I... Apparently, you guys have like Jungkook... No, sorry, Jungkook photo cards. Is that true? Sorry, what? Do you guys have Jungkook photo cards? No, we don't have it. Oh. Do you like BTS? Um, yeah. No? Wait, sorry, I just wanted to order a Happy Meal, but I, I was just curious because I wanted to know. I never tried it, so I don't know. Oh, you never tried it? Oh, shit. Um, well, well, do you have a boyfriend? Okay, sorry, sorry I'm playing, I'm playing. Um, can I just get a Happy Meal? Which one? Uh, surprise me. Okay. Wait, wait, hold, wait, 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 come back, come back. Do you actually have like BTS meals though? Cause I'd, I'd rather get that. Okay. Hi, 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 okay, okay. Let What's me just. Uh, honestly, I don't care. Just surprise me. At this point, yeah. Oh, okay. All right, all right, okay. I'll see you up, up soon, yeah. Stop it. Yeah, that's it. All right, bye, bye. I really don't care what the hype is. I care. Yep. Rum. Yep. I'll bet you ten bucks, ten dollars for you to chug this. Yeah, let's if do it. it. Shake on it. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, let's do it. What percent is this? It's like thirty-five. Thirty-five percent. <laughs> oh, and if oh, if the uh, the tip of the bottle, the lid area. Once it comes off from my lips, yeah, then it's done. It's done. That's a lot, dude. That's a lot. That's probably like what fucking four or five shots. Yeah, I think so. Ten dollars with ten dollars. <sighs> if you can't do it, you do twenty push-ups. That's least you can do. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Wait, well, yeah, okay, I, I gotta see it, bro. Don't do that. No, I'm smelling, I'm smelling. Okay, I know, I'm when you chug it, chug it like that. Bro! Hey, what is this? What is this? Hey, you lose! Yeah, you win, bro. You win. <laughs> Why would you do that? Ten bucks, man. I'm ten dollars richer, bro. Have some more coke, dude. Have some more coke. You gotta drink it. You gotta drink it. Why would you do that? Ten bucks, bro. Easy ten. Yo, eat some, eat some McDonald's, dude. No, 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 Actually, I'm chill, I'm chill, I'm chill, I'm chill, I'm chill. We're not. I'm chill. I'll be fine. Why would you do that? I'll be fine for a bit. I think my tolerance has allowed me to consume. A moderate amount. Moderate? <laughs> That's not moderate, bro. Yeah, it was a little bit of one. <laughs> do, do you all know when you restock? Probably Monday. Monday? Yeah, so just like come back either tomorrow or Monday and we'll be like Okay, and the last question, do you have a boyfriend? Honestly, I'm-